Hi guys, um, today we are working on this VWT6. We're doing a whole host of upgrades to it, but this specific video is about fog lights. So, as you can probably tell, um, fairly basic front end, but it does have the Sportline uh, front bumper on it. So the lower half that's been added in addition to the standard stock Volkswagen front bumper. Now, you'll probably see down here, we've got these grills here with the inserts already in them. We are gonna be removing these and installing the factory fitted uh, front fog lights. I've already got the headlight switch out. So you can see that um, James and Rich are already working on the vehicle and this is what's being removed and to, to then be upgraded to give it the front fog light upgrade. So this is what we're looking at at the moment and we'll stop in later on during the video just to show you where we're at in terms of a little bit of the wiring with the bumper off possibly, just depends how much time we get. Um, but what I'll do in a second is I'll jump forward and show you some of the parts that we're gonna be fitting just so you get an idea. Right, just so you can have a quick look at some of the parts that were fitting for this fog light upgrade. So even though it's got the sport line front end on it, uh, behind the scenes we have to fit these new trim panels to the original bumper. This is what these fog lights then sit into and then the sport line parts pop out and sort of poke through. So these are the headlights, oh sorry, the fog lights that are going to be going in. Um, they've already been upgraded with a LED equivalent because the customer wanted a nice bright white solution when using and unlocking and all this sort of stuff. New headlight switch, um, which has got the auto function and then the front and rear fog lights so that you can activate them. And then we've got all the associated wiring, which I won't bore you to death with. So this is what we're going to be fitting. I'll try and uh, remember to do the video when we've got the front bumper off and we're starting to put a few bits in just so you can see a little bit behind of what we're doing. Uh, but yeah, stay tuned. Okay, so very quick update for you. Um, van is progressing quite nicely. Uh, the front bumper is off. Richard has started the work on said bumper in terms of the fog light grills that need to be removed and go in. So uh, this was what was originally on the van behind the sport line trim. So you can see it all here and it takes a bit of skill to be able to remove the existing one and then fit this one in so that the light can then go through. And then as mentioned as well, here's the insert for the sport the front line, the sport line part of the bumper that also has to be removed. So Richard is just about to start building the light units back into the bumper um, so that it can then go up into the vehicle and then he will then start running all the wiring through the vehicle and into the BCM and the headlight switch that the new one that we talked about earlier. So then we can then code it up all afterwards. Okay, so the last little bit of the fog light install involves the wiring. So we've gone down through here. So you can see this nice braided cable that's going up in, into the engine bay. And then it feeds and follows all the way around down here and then goes into the cockpit. So at the moment, uh, Richard is just doing the last part of the wiring into the vehicle electronics. As you can see, he's got the, the headlight switch going on over there. Just doing his last few bits and then it's all connected up. So what we'll do is we'll skip forward and we'll show you the end result. It all in, working and uh, working as it should do. Okay, right. So van is all back together. Front bumper back on, all wired up, headlight switch in. So Richard's just sat inside the van and he's going to quickly just listen out to what I say so that you can see uh, these new fog lights that we've installed. So... Um, there's the, there's the new fog light in its housing. Um, we've taken out the sport line split apart. We've fitted the new trim that goes behind just here. And then there's the, uh, the new light cluster itself just there. Now, as part of this, the customer has gone and bought his own LEDs. So normally you'd get sort of a, uh, a yellowy tinged light halogen bulb that would go in there, but he's upgraded to this newer style, which is this sort of bluey white LED. Um, I'm just gonna quickly just zip round just to show you the new headlight switch that's been fitted. So you'll see it just here. As I mentioned it earlier, so we've got the new functions here and Richard will just spin it around to the left to be able to get those new functions. So, Rich is gonna just uh, listen out. I'm just gonna get myself set up. Oh, oh, bear with me. There we go. Right, okay, so 
Rich, if you just uh, pop on the main lights. So those are the new headlights that we fitted as well as part of this retrofit, but we're going to talk about that in another video. And Richard is just going to pop on the fog lights. And there we go. So uh, sort of a whitish blue purpley light from those LEDs, but they're factory spec. So that means that they are as per factory pretty much and we get a nice light that will come on when the fogs are on at the front and also if you've got like auto lights and stuff like that they can come on so if you've got a van um that needs fog lights either genuine or we can do aftermarket but oe spec so it's in this situation then we can do that for you um as always if you enjoy these videos um please make sure you do subscribe it really does help us out and we really do enjoy seeing that subscriber count go up if you want any videos doing or something in mind then just give us a shout we're always happy to accommodate and um yeah as always thanks for watching